Streaming now, this is the Wood TV Live Desk. Good afternoon, everyone. Phil Panarski here with the Wood TV Live Desk. Hope you're having a great start to your Thursday. A first of its kind event is coming to Kellogg Arena this Saturday. It's the inaugural Glizzy Fest this Saturday, and it celebrates all things hot dogs. Jeremy Andrews, Kelly Walden, and Jane Bolden are all here to break everything down for us. Thank you all so much for being here today. Thank you, Thank Phil. Thanks for having us. Of course. <laughs> you know, first things first. Um, kind of wanted to talk on what exactly Glizzy Fest is for people that maybe don't know. It's actually a hot dog competition that you guys are bringing to the city of Battle Creek. So kind of just give us the ins and outs of what exactly goes into Glizzy Fest. Well, Glizzy Fest is a uh, convening of hot dog vendors at the Kellogg Arena that are in a competition. So we, uh, we've created this competition uh, to have uh, Coney Dogs and Loaded hot dogs in the competition. So vendors will come, um, sell their dogs to um, guests that, that uh, pay to attend. And they'll also be judged uh, by local chefs and uh, other local foodies. And we will give awards at the end of the event. Uh, and there'll also be a People's Choice Award during that, that uh, people can go and vote on their favorite glizzy. Mm -hmm. And Jeremy, this kind of, you know, follows suit in that. I mean, how did you guys even come up with an idea like this to bring, uh, you know, to, to hold a whole festival centered solely around hot dogs? Well, uh, Phil, we were scouring uh, the internet and uh, looking at Urban Dictionary and came across this word glizzy. And uh, uh, also some kids, uh, some, some Gen Zers told us that we should have a glizzy fest. I myself did not know what the heck a glizzy was, uh, but after uh, intensive research, uh, we learned and then we decided that would be a great event for uh for battle creek for some vendors to bring people here uh from uh from the region to come and check out uh some of the vendors that we have in town but we also have uh vendors from out of town participating so we, we consider this a regional draw event uh to bring people to battle creek and support small businesses Absolutely. It is a very unique event. And Jade, I kind of want to switch gears now towards you. Uh, there's actually going to be a pretty special guest coming to Glizzy Fest this year. Talk to us about who, uh, if people do decide to show up to the festival, who are they going to see? Yes, so we will be having the Oscar Mayer Wienermobile in the event. Really, really excited. Um, they are actually scheduled to be here. So if everyone was to go to, I think it's KHC. Just a second. Um, you can actually track it. So if you go to khcmobiletour.com, you actually can see that they are geared to be here on Saturday. Um, you'll be able to take pictures with the Winter Mobile. Um, just I think just to see it in person is really exciting because it's a big hot dog. Um, <laughs> so yeah, and that's exciting. So. Yeah, no, and it really is just perfect timing with Glizzy Fest having the Wiener Mobile in town back in West Michigan. Uh, Kelly, kind of switching gears now, you're running from the Kellogg Arena's point of view now. Uh, why was it important for Kellogg Arena to get in on the Glizzy Fest and also be able to bring it to the people of Battle Creek? That was a great opportunity to bring people down to the arena and to get to see it, uh, downtown Battle Creek. It's a super easy event to access, so it's a $5 admission. And then there's parking all around the arena. Um, we're attached to the parking structure, or you can find a spot in any of the downtown city lots. And then once you get in, then you just go and pay the vendors. You don't have to buy a ticket in advance to spend a certain amount on hot dogs. You just directly purchase from each vendor that is located here. Right, no, simple, easy enough like that. Uh, now I have a question for all three of you before we let you go. You know, we do appreciate you being here today, but uh, maybe starting with Jeremy, you know, why is Glizzy Fest the place to be this weekend? Why would you recommend everybody who can and is able to j head on down to Battle Creek this weekend to head on out to Glizzy Fest? Well, not only is this a Glizzy competition, Phil, but uh, there's a number of other elements that we're going to have here. The Oscar Mayer Wienermobile was mentioned, but we also are going to have Glizzy Games, uh, so people doing interesting things with hot dogs. Um, I think that's going to be the website name next year. And um, we're going to have a Glizzy Gobbler competition. Uh, the Sprout uh, new co-op uh, booth is going to run that. And we're going to have, uh, normally at our food festivals, we have a band. Uh, but this year, uh, for this event, because we think it's a little bit more irreverent and silly, we hired a DJ that also specializes in karaoke. And so we're going to do... Uh, a bunch of 
ridiculous karaoke or serious karaoke if you're one of them. I'm a ridiculous karaoke guy, but we welcome people that are you know really into karaoke and uh, think that they're really awesome as well. Uh, I hope to get a spot uh, singing up there. It won't be very singing like, but it'll be um, embarrassing and probably horrible. <laughs> and Kelly, same question. <clears throat> And I just think it's a great stop for dinner. Bring your whole family down here, kids 12 and under get in free, and you can all get a sample of each of the different hot dogs and you got dinner for the night. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, and Jade, same question to you. Why is Glizzy Fest the place to be this Saturday? It's the place to be because the first 500 attendees will get one of these and will be entered to in a Glizzy basket full of goods, so we have like, the Oscar Mayer coffee cup. We have socks. We have we have bucket hats, aprons, you name it. I think it's an awesome opportunity to one, eat some amazing hot dogs, but be able to possibly win some awesome gifts as well. So I'm hoping to see a lot of people there. Mm -hmm, absolutely. Even more reason to, for people to show up. And I do want to remind everybody that if you would like to know a little bit more information about Glizzy Fest or when it's happening, you can find everything you need to know right now over on our website, Wood TV. Com. If you're watching us on Facebook, just head on down to the description box or the comment section. You'll find a link directly there. Guys, thank you so much for being here today on the live desk. We really do appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Of course. And I want to thank everybody else for tuning into this live.